Yo, yo, what's up guys? Gecko here, and today we are continuing our Nuzlocke Bluntlock challenge. Uh, so we had just ended in the wild area. We got an, a capture here. Our team so far is Rocky the Squirrel, Bug Scorebunny, Diablo the Rookity, and Jackie the Tyrogue, which was our catch in the wild area right here. Um, we can get another capture in the wild area after each gym. That's how we're playing with wild area captures. But for now, we have Jackie. That's all we can get here. Um, as we go through, though, I mean, it will be good if we go around and collect the watts from these dens, which we'll be able to spend on TMs, which is going to be a very, very important part of this challenge. So we want to make sure that we get as many watts as possible whenever we visit the wild area. And like I mentioned before, once we are strong enough and feel confident enough to do some of these raid battles. Um, that's also going to be pretty important too because um, beating these... Oh, this would be a good one, but we can't fight this right now. Um, beating the raid battles also gives you TRs, um, which are moves that um, the TMs you can't buy. We're going to have to find those from beating Pokemon of that same type. Um, TRs being the... Um, technical records as they're called in this game which are one-time use like the TMs used to be in the older games so we have those in addition to TMs being some of the attacks as well so the wild area is kind of our best friend in this run I feel all right just gonna get some berries here whoop we got jumped by a grubbin Hi, little dude. I mean, we we might as well fight it while we're here. Why not? This thing already outspeeds us. Well, dang. I suppose that's not too unusual with this. Oh, okay. Well, oh, it's a level 14. Eh, forget it. We're going to run. Oh, or we're not. Okay, yeah, it's time for a polka doll. This is what I was saying about these actually being pretty helpful items in this area if you come across something that's stronger than you're ready to take on. Um, luckily, that didn't like end too disastrously. We just took... No, Deli Bird? Deli Bird? Deli Bird, no! Hi. Hi. Hey, that's impressive that it can fly with one arm. With one wing, I'm not gonna lie. I'm impressed, Deli Bird. You don't need to show off anymore. I think, yeah, I was gonna say, I think there are some items that spawn around here. Oh, there's this too. Oh, I mean, that's free money, man. Um, just for the sake of time and forging ahead, we're gonna take a look at the TR guy next to Moto Stoke where we're going. And just see if there's anything where we do really, really want to collect more watts and try to get. If there's not, um, we're just going to move on for now. We'll, we will always come back later at various points. Um, I can, we can do kind of more of this this collecting and grinding for stuff. Oh. Yes, yes, we know. We know what watts are. We know what they are. Thank you. Thank you. All right. There's our man. Show me what you got, dude. I want to spend my watts. What have we got? Yeah, see, these are all pretty expensive. Crunch is, like, the cheapest one, and we can't even get this. Like, these would be really good to have, but this is what I was talking about. Like, we're not going to be able to afford these this early. Even if I go around to, like, every single den that we haven't collected from yet, I, I doubt we'll have enough. So, unfortunately, no. There's not really anything helpful for us right now, but that's okay. We've still got quite a lot of... Um, like, lots of routes and stuff to do before we actually fight the first gym. So, um, by that point, we'll be higher levels, potentially find new items and stuff. So, this journey is just starting, dudes. I actually think Motostoke is probably my favorite city in this game. Just the design is so freaking cool. I love the gears everywhere, kind of the mechanical feel of it. Yeah, like those spinning cogs throughout the city, almost like... The whole thing kind of feels like a clock. It's really cool. And there are also... Oh, hello. 
Over here. Hi, Sonya. Real ace of you to make it through the wild area. Seems like your trek ran your Pokemon ragged, though. You should pop into the Pokemon Center. Besides, there's something in there I bet you'll get a kick out of if you're a real trainer and all. Oh my gosh, Yamper's with us. It's so adorable. Looks like the Rotami's free. Rotami are a kind of Rotom information service, a handy machine for trainers. You can even use one to customize your league card, which we will be doing because, of course, you need to do that. Why don't you try playing around with your league card, Gecko? Here's a sample for you. Oh, snap, we got Leon's card, man. Heck yeah. Motostoke sure is big. Not to worry, Sonya's here to show you around a bit. Come find me after you heal your Pokemon. The opening ceremony, huh? I get a bit worked up when I think how exciting and moving it was to actually stand on the stadium's pitch for the first time. Oh yeah, she yeah she used to be a trainer. She was Leon's rival. I kind of skipped through that scene a little bit earlier on. She used to be Leon's rival. She was a trainer at one point as well. Obviously, like he surpassed her and his is like this unbeatable champion now. Um, but yeah, she she was a trainer at one point. I like to think that Yamper was the ace of her team. The little, our little corgi friend. Also, the Pokemon of Wedgehurst Station, the Galarian Slowpoke, we're not going to be using that. Um, it's like kind of an event Pokemon thing that I don't really consider part of the main game, so we're not going to be doing that. Um, no, I don't need my PC. I wanted... Hello? Yes, use the card maker. I want to make a card. We don't really have that much stuff right now. We could be in Moto Stoke. I don't I don't like the plat backgrounds to be honest. It's too this this is the one I use in my like actual file um of my normal playthrough when I first played the game. It's the best one. But what is this one? Oh that's the station. Eh, what the heck? We'll be in Moto Stoke, why not? Should we be like hyper powered up? This kind of like flame. What 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 uh, what can we do with this? Um, no, I don't want that covering me up. How? What do we want to do with this? Here, let me remind myself what poses we can do. That one's pretty fun. That one's fun. I like how that looks with the effect we picked. That one's fun too. I used that one for my previous Nuzlocke. It's cute. Oh, there we go. Oh, that's per that's perfect, dude. We're going freaking Super Saiyan. What? What? Um. Let me let me find the perfect. There we go. There we go. There it is. There it is. I just need to adjust where we are a little bit. Actually, wait. We should... No, I want to be... Oops. I keep messing up the controls when I'm doing this. No, we want to be head-on. There. That's what I want. Like, that. Beautiful. Beautiful. Print it. Gotta give this to all my buddies. Alright. Anyway, now that that is done... Very important part of our journey. Gotta get that league card looking schnazzy. Brilliant young trainer who's braved the wild area. Do you remember what your goal in Motostoke is? Uh, You seriously forgot the gym challenge opening ceremony? By the way, the ceremony tomorrow is being held at the Motostoke Stadium, okay? Use that lift over there to get to the stadium, okay? Will do. Laters, I'm going to swing by the shops while I'm here, but don't forget to register at the stadium, okay? Yeah, so there are two very, very important shops in here that we need to go to. One is that there's a new clothing store. We got to upgrade our outfit, guys. It's essential. Two, there's a salon here as well where we can change our hairstyle. So you already know. This is where our money's going this episode. All right, let's customize, man. Let's like really, really get our character figured out of what we're gonna look like. 
All right, what kind of look do we want? That's kind of cute. I'm thinking of going for kind of like a more feminine, like stereotypically feminine look in this playthrough. Cause I, I usually don't do that with my character cause that's like not my own style. Oh, that's kind of cute. The little braid thing in back. I also like that. This is what I used in my other playthrough. Pigtails. I don't think I've ever seen someone use the pigtails. I, maybe I'll do that. It's the ponytail that's kind of plain. Pigtails. It's pretty simple. The braids are cool. I like it. Mm. Alright. Oh, that's, that's all our options. You can't choose a fringe style. Wait, no, I'm not done. I I am. Okay, so it depends what style you want. I le let's do... I want to do these because I, I have not come across anybody online that uses this. What What is this? Oh, this is you can change your bangs. Dude, the guys got shafted by this game. I'm pretty sure you can't even do stuff like this. I could be wrong, but they have, like, no good style options. None... Sides. I kind of just like that. Now, what color is the question? Do we want something kind of wacky? Like, dude, we could just be an anime girl. Like, what if we have blue hair? That's so bright. I kind of wish it was less saturated than that. Green. Oh my gosh, dude. White. Bro, I, I am tempted to just make a freaking anime girl right now. Look at this. This reminds me of... um. Anna from Fire Emblem. The hairstyle's not exactly the same, but she does have kind of a pigtail thing going on. What the heck? Let's do this. Why not? Yes. All done. Is this too much red with the pants we're wearing? Well, we can always... We might be changing our outfit anyway. Yes, I want to reprint my card. But we're not done yet because there's one other thing we have to do. We need to change our eye color as well. Because that's something you can do. And if we're going to be an anime girl, these are not the eyes we want. Okay, we need... Okay, the regular are fine. We want to have... Wait, what, what did we pick for our hair? Red. There. Cat eye. Oh my gosh. I didn't even know you could do this. Oh yeah, we got to do that. Okay, where's... Look at this, bro. What else can we do, though? The hearts. There's the fiery one. No, dude, we have to do this. Either this or this. No, I kind of like this. Oh my gosh, this is too much, man. We can put lipstick on. Maybe that? I don't know, man. No, I, for now, no lipstick. I just wanted the anime eyes. Yes. Look at us. We're freaking adorable. Yes, I'll reprint my card for our new outfit. This doesn't even look like the same character anymore. Alright, let's check out what outfits we can get here. Oh my gosh, our pigtails sway as we run. This was the best decision ever. Look at this. Oh my goodness, this is too much to handle. Hey, Sonia, you getting a new style too? There's a polywag shirt. That's freaking adorable. Oh, that's cute. Yeah, like, okay, kind of hoodie type things. Our varsity jackets. No, but, okay, we want, like, the most anime thing possible. I don't really know if there's much. Oh, my goodness. Guys, we're gonna. We can go full anime. We can go anime schoolgirl with the little short skirt. Oh my gosh, this is too much. Why am I having more fun with this than like anything else in the game? This is expensive as crap, dude. That's okay, we got stuff to sell. This is obviously the most important thing to buy. No, we, we need her, her eyes to be showing. We're, we're gonna take our glasses off after this so we can really see those anime eyes. I actually kind of like this. Is that, does that look weird? I don't know. I'm gonna get it. You guys tell me if it looks weird. It kind of clashes with the pink skirt, but like there aren't that many other top options that I feel work very well. Maybe the polywag shirt? I don't know. 
Yes. Yes. Update the league card. This is beautiful, guys. I'm so happy. I don't I don't know about this orange shirt. I don't know about this. You guys let me know if it looks weird. I don't know how much I'm digging this. All right, let's see what we look like. That's beautiful. Look at this. Oh my gosh. This character is amazing. Dude, I just... Oh my gosh. that I spent so much time doing that. It's like the whole episode is just going to be shopping for crap. All right. Oh, I, I swore there was an item over here. Maybe not. Maybe I'm thinking of a different area of the city. Oh, here. It's on this side. Paralyze heals. Okay. Oh. Hello. Oh, hi Charizard. I'd surely never make it to the stadium without you to show me the way, partner. Even with the huge old thing like this bang in the middle of the city, I still get lost. Gecko, alright? One look tells me you've become a trainer worthy of the endorsement I gave you, and I reckon you might even be ready to use this. Ooh, what is it? Charcoal. Oh, you know what? Okay, this is not helpful for Score Bunny like he thinks it is. There is another very, very important item in the wild area that we need to go get. And I actually mean it this time. Not in the same way that I say clothing is important. It's it's actually going to be a very, very good item to have. It's actually kind of crazy we can get it this early in the game. Alright, here we go. The leftovers. We can get leftovers this early in the game, um, which is amazing. So... Let's see. I think I'm going to give this to... Not to Rocky. To, um... Bugs, probably? Or maybe Diablo. He's a little more defensive, isn't he? Oops. Let's see. We've got, like, 11 and 12, 14 and 16. But he is a little bit higher level. Yeah, because, like... Yeah, I guess we'll give it to Bugs right now. I'm looking at who has the highest HP to get the most mileage out of it. Rocky, we want to use berries because of the cheek pouch ability. So let's give Bugs some leftovers. Open the bag. Take your leftover carrots, my dude. Yeah, leftovers. Give that to you. Okay, fantastic. Now that's taken care of. Vicavolt, please don't hurt me. Vicavolt, no, 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 no! Okay, um... <laughs> please, please don't hurt us. Bugs, we gotta run. Don't don't try to win this battle. We gotta get out of here, my buddy. Get the heck out of here. Bye. I think one of the most terrifying things that's ever happened to me in the wild area is I was on... Um, no, I don't know. I thought it was over here. I guess not. There's like this small island in the middle of one of the bodies of water. And... In certain conditions, beware can spawn there in massive quantities. So I was surrounded by like seven bewares all descending upon me. Their models are like twice as big as the character, all coming to kill me, and it was terrifying. Okay, guys, I bought the polywag shirt. I have a problem. Yeah, I'm done shopping. I I had to do it. the The sweatshirt was weird, or the sweater thing. I didn't like how the colors matched. Now we have a cutesy polywag shirt. It's perfect. We also have no money now. It's totally worth it. Ooh, shiny. A super potion. Nice. We don't even need that this early in the game, but that's okay. Alright, hi Leon. It's time to go. There's, there's our homie, man. There's the homie ball guy. No, hop! Let me talk to my best friend. Hello. You made it too. Yes. This is where the ceremony will be held. Everyone will be watching for the gym challenge. My mom, your mom, the whole world. It's getting me nervous, really. No, this isn't nerves. I'm only trembling because I'm so excited. Come on, Gecko. It's time we learned, the world learned our names. Okay, can I talk to my best friend, though, please? Thank you. Hi, ball guy. Ta-da! You took time to talk to a Pokeball, so you deserve a little reward. I love this man. I'm in love. In case you were wondering, I'm not just any old Pokeball. But then who am I, you ask? Well, the answer is simple. They call me the Ball Guy. Best NPC ever. Love. 
Look at all these peeps. Would you look at this? The place is packed with gym challengers. Every one of these folks is another rival. Let's get signed up. Hmm? Who could this be? Who could this be? Hello? I'm sorry. That was horrible. I, I'm sorry. I'm not funny. Oh, it, do it doesn't even tell us his name. <laughs> Bead, wait. Seriously, what a piece of work. Hop, he didn't even say anything. Wait, I forgot that Bead doesn't actually talk to you yet. You just see him. I was thinking that he says something here. Fancy that. This is the first time we've had a challenger endorsed by the champion. Well, now you've had two, because I am as well. Two of you at once. I wonder what's come over Leon this year. You must be something special. I'm Hop, Leon's little brother, in fact, and the next champion. Get me all signed up, would you? Well, yes, I'm trying to, if you'll just give me a moment. Be patient, Hop. We've been registered. Heck yeah. And our number... I mean, I always go with four. It's my lucky number. We're not doing a meme number. I'm sorry. I actually would do a meme number, but they have all been done to death. Like, everybody has used 69 and 420. We're not doing that. I'm sorry. It's funny, but, but I feel like every like playthrough I've seen, people do that. So I'm sorry that I'm boring. I'm going with my lucky number. Hi, Marnie. You're looking a bit gobsmacked by all this. You must be from a small country town, is that it? I'm quite the same myself. Hi, Morpico. Oh, no, I was trying to talk to your Pokemon, Marnie. Hi! He's so adorable. There are heaps of us starting out like this, but only a small number will make it to the end. I love this guy. This guy is actually one of the challengers. I'm like, you go, dude. Fulfill your dreams. It doesn't matter how old you are. If you dreamed of being a trainer, you never got the chance to do it before. You go, dude. Absolutely. And if I remember right, he actually makes it to the 8th gym. You can talk to him, like, before the final challenge. He's still in it, dude. That guy is sick. The Badoo drop in is this way, if you'd be so kind as to follow me. Man, I forgot how much introductory kind of stuff there still is, dude. We've arrived at the Badoo drop in. We, we actually genuinely will get to an actual route soon, but we have to do this opening ceremony thing. Although we do get to do a couple battles right now, so there's that at least. Hiya, looks like you both got yourself registered. Sonia, what are you doing at the hotel? I'm researching the mysterious Pokemon that are said to be in the slumbering wield. I reckon if I look into some of the legends, I might figure it out. Care to join me? What's this, then? Sta a statue of the hero who once saved the Gallant region. I could run through the legend quick if you fancy. The short version. A great black storm covered the Gala region called the Darkest Day. The land was assaulted by gigantic Pokemon, but they were defeated by a single young hero with a sword and shield. The statue is to depict the hero of that legend. I suppose the hero must have been about as strong as Lee, then. Looks like you're going to have your hands full with plenty to research, Sonya. Black storms and swords and shields and all. You'll be alright. She's fine. I'll muddle through somehow, don't you worry. You two are staying at the hotel tonight, aren't you? Shouldn't you check in? Probably so, and we'll look out for you too. If we hear anything about a hero, we'll tell you. Alrighty. Let's make sure we got the right dudes up front. Yeah, we'll just we'll just use bugs for now. Um, these guys are gonna have dark types, so if I remember right. Or poison, but yeah, hi, we'll battle. Look at these punks. Didn't we tell you, mate? You're getting our way and you're in for a battle. Team Yell is all about helping. Helping one very special trainer with the gym challenge. We want to make sure she gets cheered on nice and proper and you're going to help us make some noise. Hey, I'm down, dude. I'm Marnie's fan, too. You don't got to tell me. Zigzagoon. I love Galarian Zigzagoon so much. I'm absolutely in love with this thing. And the way it does the little zigzag run when it attacks, it's so cute, dude. Oh, 
Oh, I forgot we have Swift. Wait, that's going to be way stronger. I forgot we taught that. That was a crit. I mean, Swift doesn't matter at this point. We're going to take it out, but that would have been a faster way. Yay! Looking for a fight and I lost. I'm so pathetic. Nah, no, dude, you're fine. Don't say that about yourself. Give me a break. TV, I'll get revenge for me, would ya? Bring it on, punk. I got you covered. What could be better than a battle in a hotel lobby? I mean, there are better locales we could be fighting in, but I mean, I suppose a hotel will do. Nick it. Alright, let's try out our new move, eh? Swift. Okay, that did not even do that much damage. Um, one thing I'm considering doing is having, like, a, a limit on how many healing items we can use in a battle. Just because I find it really lame to just sit there spamming potions and stuff to win. Um, it just kind of takes away a lot of the challenge of a Nuzlocke. Um, the whole point is supposed to be it's harder. And it's just, like, not very interesting to watch or play that way either, to be honest. So, um, I'm not sure how I'm going to implement that. I might do that only for important battles, like maybe just for the gym battles and maybe also potentially rival battles. Um, we might do some rule where it's, like, you can only use, like, five healing items during the fight or something like that. Um, when we come to the first gym battle, we'll kind of make a final decision, but that is something I'm considering implementing. Um, if you guys have thoughts on it, you can let me know. It, it's, like, five items per important battle. Reasonable? Should we do less than that? Should we implement that for all battles, not just important ones? I don't- let me know what you think. Man, the swanky, sophisticated air in here had me off my game. I couldn't keep my cool. I wasn't expecting checking in would be such a big fuss. What's going on? Sneaking in some battles without me? Don't think you can get ahead that easily. I need to get training in, so I'm joining. I'll even heal your Pokemon, too. Yeah, let's show him who's boss, Hop. The one who's going to be the next champion. Let's have a nice two-on-two. -two. I thoroughly enjoy double battles, man. I wish there were more of them. I can hear my victory coming. Yeah, yeah. Look at these little cuties. Yes, join me, Wulu. Does Swift hit both? I think it might. Heck yeah. That's fantastic. Leave me alone. Go away. Mm, that's not really that strong. I feel like it would be more efficient to hit one thing at a time. The, the Zigzagoon will die more quickly, so I think we'll go for that. Don't need my special attack, dude. I don't even need that. We're just gonna smack you right in the face. And actually, if we it looks like we're gonna level up from this battle with how much experience we'll get. And we are gonna learn double kick at level 12. So this is pretty great. Yeah, get him. Get him. Oh my gosh. It's actually pretty strong. It's not really anything to be worried about, but um, I think I actually am going to go for Swift now to just get that little bit of damage there while still hitting this guy. Leave me alone, dude. Go for the Wulu. Wulu's thick as heck. It's not going to do anything. Don't hurt the little bunny. Given the choice of a bunny... Oh, it's over now, dude. You're about to get kicked in the face. Alright, let's get rid of Tackle. I mean, we don't need this anymore. The choice between a rabbit and a sheep, and you choose to beat up the rabbit. What are you doing? Dude, Wulu is just bulking up right now.
Alright. Time to try out your new move, Bugs. Kick him in the face. Dude, that did, that did nothing. Oh, heck yeah. Look at that damage, dude. We are getting more type, type coverage, and I love it. I almost said kype coverage. That is not the correct term for that. My voice is unsure when I'm sad. I want to yell, but I'm unsure. I came to see the gym challenge ceremony, but this is awful. It's okay, guys. It was defeat that I heard coming. I think I'm about to cry. What are you lot doing here? Marnie? Nothing. We were just... I know you're all terribly curious about the other challengers, but you gotta show restraint. Sorry about them. They're just a bunch of my fans. Call themselves T Team Yell and follow me around cheering for me. I think they've let it go to their heads a bit. Come on, you lot. Back home with you now. They're so caught up wanting to support me that they tend to get surety with other challengers. Sorry if they caused you trouble. So you're a challenger too? Team Yell was it? Pretty impressive. You already have a set of fans. I love her hairstyle, dude. It's so sick. Hi. Um, okay, we're gonna call it, but I, let's just, here, thanks for always tagging along, I hope you can keep it up. Leon really worries about him, he practically raised him after all. Oh, that's adorable. Um, I think we're gonna call it here, should we, yeah, we've already, this is already getting pretty long. I think we're gonna call it here, um, next we'll be able to do the opening ceremony, and then, like, that's when you are allowed to go on to the first route, and, well, the, first route after this city where we can actually really start getting into you know the meat of the game um so thank you guys so much for watching i hope you're enjoying the challenge so far um and i hope you stick around for the next one and continue to enjoy the series see ya